areas where we have provided. I now recognize Mr. Jordan from Ohio. For Thank you, minutes. Mr. Chairman. Doctor, why did you and the Biden administration mislead the American people? Um, you'd have to say more. I'm Mark, wouldn't claim March 29, 2021, vaccinated people do not carry the virus. Vaccinated people don't get sick. We got that information from clinical trials, but also real world data. Seems to me there are a number of statements you make in there that aren't accurate. Um, do vaccinated people carry the virus? In March of 2021, um, the vast majority of data demonstrated that the vast majority of people were not getting infected if they were vaccinated. That's not what you said. You didn't say the vast majority of people. You said vaccinated people do not carry the virus. Was that accurate? Uh, it was generally accurate. Generally accurate. Why not just be accurate? Why not just tell the American people the truth? Why not say, why not you say to the American people just what you said to me? We're big boys and girls. We pay your salary. The government is supposed to be of the people, by the people, for the people. Why not just tell us the truth? Uh, I was speaking well, six weeks later when you said if you were to get infected during post vaccination, you can't give it to anyone else. Was that accurate? Uh, what was the date of that? May 19, 2021. Um, at the time we had the Wuhan strain and then the Alpha strain that was the Alpha strain that was circulating. That was generally true. Yeah. Generally true again. Why not again? Why not tell the American people this is generally true? Um, I couldn't tell you the exact data on the vaccine effectiveness of symptomatic disease and severe disease at the time. What I can tell you is that we generally saw that if you were to get infected after you had been vaccinated, that you were not carrying the virus by transmitting it to somebody else. You could not transmit it to others. But we know that's not accurate. It was at the time. Now, what really? happened? Yes, in really? May of 2021, it, what, that was hap that was true really? for the Alpha variant. What what well, happened? Let me ask you about the, all the general statements that were made to the American people. Not general statements, the way you guys said it. You said, uh, was it our tax dollars? Were, were our tax dollars used in the lab in, in China? Uh, that is something that you would have to speak to NIH about. Our tax dollars were used. Uh, it, it sure looks like it was gain of function research. It sure looks like it actually came from the lab. And we've had several agencies, federal agencies, say that's in fact where the virus originated. The Biden administration told us that the vaccinated couldn't get it. We know that's not accurate. The, the Biden administration told us the vaccinated couldn't transmit it. They told us masks worked and they told us there was no such thing as natural immunity. That seems to me to be what seven different statements that turned out not to be true that we got from this administration. Again, why not just tell the American people the truth? Um, so I would dispute some of what you just said. In October 2021, CDC released a scientific brief highlighting all of the science that was out there on infection-induced immunity. And there, I, I don't know the long list that you, I don't remember all the long list, but there are numerous areas where we have provided science um, and the science review to, to provide data to the American people as soon as we had it. I actually think what happened is you actually tried to be honest with the American people and the Biden administration shot you down. You remember when you said this? In February, this is before you made these statements, which I think are not uh, not being square with the American people. You said vaccination of teachers is not a prerequisite for safely reopening schools. Did you make that statement? Uh, something to that effect. I can't exactly say the quote, but yeah. Vaccination of teachers is not a prerequisite for safely reopening schools. I think you made that statement on February 3rd. Um, do, you, do you stand by that statement? Um, at the time, yeah. I, that we, we had an, uh, a week later or 10 days later, we had an operational guidance that demonstrated layered mitigation strategies and that you could safely reopen. Were you, speaking as, were you speaking as Dr. Walensky or were you speaking as Dr. Walensky, head of the CDC? Um, I have said that while I've been in front of Congress and the media um, and press conferences, I, during my tenure as CDC director, I've been speaking as the CDC director. But that's not what the White House said, right? Uh, Jen Zaki said, Dr. Walensky spoke to this in her personal capacity. Do you remember that statement? I do. Uh, who's right? Uh, you Jen Zaki or you? Well, I will tell you that I was speaking in my, my um, looks role to me, as the CDC looks to, me, looks to me like what happened is in February, you said, I'm going to be honest with the American people. I'm going to give it to them straight. Vaccination of teachers is not a prerequisite for safely opening schools. And the Biden administration hung you out to dry. They said, no, nope, she ain't talking for us. She ain't talking as a head of CDC, she's talking as Dr. Walensky. And then a month later, you said, well, you know what, I better not be totally honest with the American people. So I'm going to say vaccinated people do not carry the virus and they don't get sick. And everyone understands, like, wow, I know someone who's been vaccinated and they've gotten sick afterwards. I think what happened is you try to be honest and they said no. And then you said, well, I'm going to have to hedge a little bit. I'm going to have to give the American people misleading statements from the head of the CDC. You were speaking as head of the CDC in both situations, right? I have said I've been speaking as the head of the CDC. All the time? Yeah. Well, it would have been nice if you'd have just been honest and straightforward with the American people every single time 
throughout this, uh, throughout this virus. With that, I yield back. I have stood by my commitment to tell the American people what I know when I know it. Thank you.